So how do you make an echo happen before a sound rather than after? A part of me, my enemy, divided me, my enemy. The first thing you do is to take your sound and reverse it. A part of me, my enemy, yam but off then you load it up with a bunch of delay. Make sure you got the feedback cranked way up. Then you bounce that audio to a new track. Make sure you include effects in the bounce and the audio tail in the file. You end up with this crazy long region right here. First thing you want to do is to reverse that reversed region and line that up with the region you're trying to create the echo before. You might want to gain the region up like I did. Okay, so now you probably want to create a fade in so you have this swelling effect as it comes up. For even more dramatic effect, you can cut off the echo sound before the actual line starts like this. A part of me. Lastly, you might want to put a bandpass EQ on it just so it's a little thinner sounding than the actual vocal when it finally comes in. A part of me. And this is what it sounds like all together. used to hear this effect on a lot of 90s alternative music and I think even Prince used it once. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed watching. If you used the effect, let me know how you liked it. I'd love to hear it. Anyway, thanks for watching.